The contenders to be leader of the Labour Party are making last-ditch pleas to members here in its Yorkshire heartlands before the polls open next week. Current leader Jeremy Corbyn is speaking at a rally in Sheffield tonight and tomorrow. His challenger, the Welsh MP Owen Smith, is in Halifax. Our political editor, Len Tingle, has just sent us this report from Barker's Pool in Sheffield. As you can see behind me here in Barker's Pool in Sheffield, it's pretty full. There are already several hundred, maybe over a thousand people turned up. And that's despite the fact that Jeremy Corbyn himself is not due to be on stage until after seven. And the weather, it's pouring down here. Now, this is an important rally for Jeremy Corbyn. It's just a couple of days before the ballot opens. And South Yorkshire is a deliberate venue for this rally because it's really a Labour heartland, the industrial areas of South Yorkshire and West Yorkshire. Membership has grown here, and it's thought that he will have overwhelming support in this part of the world but not from the local MPs. Remember, every single MP in South Yorkshire is Labour, bar one, who happens to be Nick Clegg, the Liberal Democrat. I've spoken to quite a lot of them today. Not a single one of them will be at this rally, but a single one of them wants to be uh, to see Jeremy Corbyn continue as leader of the Labour Party. And that could give him a major problem, because if, as the bookies reckon, as the pundits reckon, Jeremy Corbyn's support among the membership, and they're the ones that have the vote, if that support among the membership is as strong as we think it is, and he wins, he will be at loggerheads yet again with all of those MPs. That could cause a split in the Labour Party. What we're seeing here tonight in Sheffield could be historic for the Labour Party that so, for so many years has been dominant here in South Yorkshire.